Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Maria and I'm here today with another video from Brazil showing you guys the Farol Santander. Um, this is when I went with my mom for the first time. I've heard about this place for so long but I never actually went there. And this is the first time I went there and I wanted to show you guys how is it. And you know, for everybody that is going to Sao Paulo, you might stop by and get to know this place. Look at this vault. It's awesome. It looks so cool. <laughs> Imagine having one in your mansion like that. They will know we have so much stuff in there. Um, these are the tickets. And this is this is where the entrance is. Like my mom just looking, texting. And we blame the generation. Come on, mom. <laughs> so this is in the elevator. My mom is talking to this lady about that she's live she lives here. She lives in Sao Paulo for her whole life, but she's never been there. And then now she's bragging about me that I live in the United States. Blah 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 very sociable and then me i'll join the conversation a little bit just you know to be sociable so this is the entrance oh my mom's saying that she needs to go to the bathroom first <laughs> so look at the pictures this is how sao paulo looks from that view this is the miranchi and what you guys are about to see is the vista the view from the miranchi so if you're looking um, for a place that you get to look at this amazing view, you know, it's like an empire state from Sao Paulo. I don't think this is the tallest building, um, but, and correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, you know, if anybody knows, but I, I don't think this is, this is the tallest one, but it still has an amazing view. And um, people always ask me, how, how is it Sao Paulo, you know, is it, is it, looks like a Rio and I'm like no it looks like New York but from Brazil so it has a lot of buildings it had it has a lot of history um, of you know different types of people different types of immigrants they came um, and they made their own you know their own space just like New York so here's more of the view um, I love it over there and I miss it I miss the fast-paced rhythm because Florida, you know, Florida is very calm. There's a lot of, um, you know, I don't live in Miami where the action is. I live in Fort Pierce, Port St. Lucie, these areas, and here is pretty, pretty country. It started to grow now, but right now it's not the same. It's not the same as a big city. So more view for you guys. <laughs> Just showing you around here. So there's like only this little space, it's a little hallway that you get to see it. And that's me. <laughs> just walking around with my piercings. My mom in the background just taking more pictures. <laughs> it's very cool to look from up, up there, you know. That's us going to the 24th floor. The, the, all the way up. So they have this little ex exhibition here um, for football, or should I say soccer? Uh, in Brazil, they say football, but here is soccer. So it's about all the, the teams. Look, it says the 32 selections of the World Cup of 2018. Deu Liga. going around there's all these flags from everywhere it's really cool to walk around there <laughs> it's like ah oh, where do I go where do I go <laughs> I think I got this thing you know take pictures and videos from my mom because she always be doing that so many flags you know sometimes we don't even recognize the places So we are in the middle. There's so many colors. <laughs> See, I even got lost there. <laughs> Belgium, Colombia. Ooh. Oh, Curacao. I've heard about this place before, but I never. I found it so cute that Coração in Portuguese is heart, so it's like, oh, wow, <laughs> a place named heart. That's we. 
You can hear my mom in the back. Coração, coração. <laughs> that is funny. So, li li Liga, in this case, is league, right? But then when you say Deu Liga, it could be also in like in a baker bakery term, which means the, the bread is right. It will, it will rise and, you know, we'll have it will be good. So, I think in this world, in this, this case, they did a, a kind of like a a word play with the with the word Liga. It has all the ones, the countries that were represented by the flags. There's clips, the best goals, the strategy, the way they did do their gameplay and everything. I'm going back now to um, another section. You guys be able to see where um, you get to press this button <laughs> and celebrate how You go this place you press the button and it shows you how it feels to win if you were <laughs> the winner i didn't know exactly what to do so i was just like oh, let me just run around a little bit yeah let's go so this was a weird part of in in the thing it, see i just told my mom that i was really scared and for her to go first so um <laughs> don't be with me in the forest so it's really, really weird. You get this. Oh, I don't know. If you have, if you know, if you're sensitive to this type of things, please skip this part. But it's really nice when you're in there. It's like, what is going on? Look at my face. Sounds like Star Wars. I have a friend who does this noise all the time. And then when you come out of there, I mean, what is this, right? But it's cool, I mean, don't get me wrong, it's cool. And then there's my mom in the back, she's like, oh, you leave the city and you go to the forest. I think it's a cool concept, you know, like. Oh, look, it's a panorama. <laughs> this lady's like, oh, I wish I have somebody to explain because, you know, we get a little confused up in here. It's like, lady, there's not a lot to explain, to be honest, but it would be nice. <laughs> like, what the heck is all this noise in the background? Like, I don't remember what the heck is coming from. Just like, what? Look, it's super cool. Wow, look at this view. Wow. Really nice. I, I get impressed, man. It's really cool to look the city from ob the above. Anyways, moving along, we're going downstairs now to another part, which is the metaverse. Oh yeah. I confess to you that at that time I didn't know what metaverse was and I did read the little thing you know the details the explanation of the exhibition and I was like oh okay very interesting but still not understanding and then a couple years later Facebook is here to show us the metaverse so it's really cool concept again if you are sensitive to these types of flashing motion lights please skip this part 
But this is really cool. Like, I like that part. My mom's saying that she's afraid to go, to move along. <laughs> she's about to demonstrate for you guys a Matrix type of movie. Or a Mission Impossible. Look, look at That was her move. That was her move right there. She's like, oh, this is how I'm going to steal that jewel. Oh, I told her that it burns, so the laser burns. I mean, I guess, right? It's a laser. <laughs> Anyways, moving forward, we have this constitutional table. I'm not sure. It's where there's this guy in the background explaining, you know. But I hope I go and I'm... It's for meetings, it says meetings. I think more like a govern government type of thing. Senhores, diante da carta do presidente do Museu de Arte Moderna, recebemos a solicitação. Oh, there you go. He's talking about. Oh yeah, he's talking about meetings and con consuls. Not consuls. Conselhos. I don't know how to say that word. But assemblies. Meetings. Meetings of important people, I guess. Moving along. This part is not so fun. So if you wanna skip this part, go ahead. Look, it's not. It's just furniture. Yeah. So don't even bother coming this way. Only if you if you like this stuff, then yes, bother. Do whatever you want, guys. Just enjoy life. Okay, moving to this section of the place. It's where they have pictures. Look. I like this. Anyways, this part, um, they put us in a little room and it has all this um, screens, screens, <laughs> and it shows you the history of Sao Paulo, how the city grew and how the city built up, how the buildings come upon and how this building in specific came upon. It's really nice. Um, I believe they do have um, an option to do it for if you if you only speak English for you to do it in English. Check this out. So it's coming to an end and then they show this is where you know, all these pictures and everything this is where we are looking the build all these views are coming from and it's really nice it looks like Empire Days, doesn't it and it's the Farol which is the lighthouse because of that it's very pretty So check this view. Not, not me, not me. Hold on, stop it. Not me, you guys. 
Look at the sun. So we left the Faro and now we are here at what? Edificio Martinelli. I wanted to finish the video showing you guys Look this amazing view as well. So we have two points of view. Is. We have you that know, one in the morning and then this one by the sunset, which is really cool. You get the contrast, you get the clouds, the sun going down. So definitely another uh, amazing group. place to we check it out. And that's the end of the video everybody thank you so much i hope you guys enjoyed this video and you got to know a little bit more about my hometown sao paulo in brazil i'm gonna leave the name and the addresses of these places so you guys can get to know over there and have these experiences for yourself sao paulo is awesome and i think it's definitely worth to get to know this amazing place thank you so much again and i hope you have a great great day thank you for watching Bye.